Hello there, and welcome to another informative video from OneSure Doctor Phone. I am Francisco, and today we're going to discuss how to manage apps on Android effectively. In this video, we're going to take you on a journey through the ins and outs of organizing, optimizing, and streamlining your app usage on your Android device. With millions of apps available on the Google Play Store, it's easy to get overwhelmed by the sheer number of choices. But you're not, as we're going to equip you with practical Android device manager tips and tricks to declutter your app collection and keep only the ones that you truly need. So before we move forward, please remember to subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon for future updates. Now let's dive right in. Part 1. Managing apps on Android is important. In today's digital age, smartphones have become an indispensable part of our lives, and Android, being one of the most popular operating systems, powers a vast majority of these devices. As we download and install numerous apps to meet our diverse needs, effective app management becomes crucial. So managing apps not only optimizes your device's performance, but also enhances our overall smartphone experience. Part 2. How to manage Android apps manually We start by delving into the essential aspects of manual app management in your Android device. To be a great Google account manager, you need to take control of your app installations, uninstalling, disabling, sharing, updating, and clearing the app cache. By doing this, you'll be able to streamline your app usage and optimize your device's performance overall. So let's go ahead and touch on some important aspects. First, installing Android apps. Google Play Store offers an incredible selection of apps that can transform your Android device into a versatile tool for productivity, entertainment, and much more. Whether you're looking for games to pass the time, utilities to boost your productivity, or social networking apps to connect with friends, you'll find it all here. In this section, we'll guide you through the simple steps to install your favorite apps and get the most out of the File Manager Android experience. On your phone, open Google Play Store, and then once you're in the Play Store, you have two main options to find apps. One is to browse different categories, while the other is using the search option to find the targeted app. After finding the app that you want to install, just go ahead and tap on its icon or name to open the apps page. Then once you're satisfied with the app's description and permissions, go ahead and tap the install button to start installing the app from there. Uninstalling Android Apps this is going to be another important aspect of being able to manage your Android device. So as you explore the world of Android apps, you might find that some apps no longer serve your needs or have simply become outdated or obsolete. So to be a good Google Android device manager, it is essential to regularly declutter your device and free up valuable storage space by uninstalling apps you no longer use. In this section, we'll walk you through the straightforward process of uninstalling Android apps. So you can just go ahead and keep your device running smoothly and efficiently. So what you need to do is just find the app that you want to remove from the device and long press its icon. Tap uninstall from the appearing options and then remove the app by selecting OK from there. Disabling Android apps. Not all pre-installed apps on your device are going to be necessary for your day-to-day -day use. Some of them might actually consume system resources, take up valuable storage space on the SD card, file manager, or even show up on your home screen, even though you rarely even use them. So this is why we would want to be able to curate what we decide to keep on our device and what we decide to enable or disable. Fortunately, Android allows you to disable these pre-installed apps, preventing them from running in the background and conserving system resources. In this section, we are going to guide you through the process of disabling Android apps, helping you streamline your device and improve its overall performance. So first, open your Android device's settings and scroll down to Apps and the Apps list, then select the targeted app and tap Disable. Confirm your action by pressing Disable App. Sharing Android Apps the joy of discovering useful or entertaining apps is even better when you can share your newfound treasures with friends and family. Android devices make it easy for you to share apps with others, allowing them to enjoy the same experience th that you love. So in this section, we're going to show you how to share Android apps using various methods, so you can spread the excitement and connect with others through the power of technology. Begin by launching Google Play Store on your device and tapping the profile icon from the top right corner. Here, choose Manage Apps and Devices, and on the ensuing screen, move to the Share Apps option from there. Choose Send and then select the app that you want to share. Now on the recipient phone, navigate to Share Apps in Google Play Store and tap Receive. Once the device name appears, select it, match the code, and choose Receive on the recipient's phone to transfer the app. Updating Android Apps As developers continuously improve their apps with new features, 
bug fixes, and security enhancements, keeping your Android apps up to date is going to be absolutely crucial. App updates not only provide you with the latest functionalities, but also ensure a smoother and more secure user experience. Now, in this section, we're going to guide you through the process of updating your Android apps so you can make the most out of the apps that you already love so much. So first, just access the Google Play Store and then tap the profile icon from the top right corner. Now press Manage Apps and Device. And on the next screen, go to the Updates Available section. Then from there, all that you have to go ahead and do is either tap the See Details to view all update available apps and update the apps one by one, or you can press update all to kickstart the updates for all of the apps that do require an update on your device. Clearing app cache on Android. Over time, Android apps accumulate temporary data called cache, which helps them load faster and store certain information for quick access. However, this cache can grow quite large and may actually occupy valuable storage space on your device. Clearing the app cache as a Vivo file manager can actually help free up storage and potentially even resolve issues related to app performance. In this section, we're going to walk you through the process of clearing the app cache on Android, ensuring your device runs smoothly and efficiently. So first things first, just go ahead and navigate to the icon and the targeted app and long press it. Choose App Info from the small pop-up menu. In the App Info screen, move to the Storage option and then just go ahead and press it. The following screen uses Clear Cache to wipe the app cache. Part 3. Managing Android apps using a third-party app. While Android devices offer native app management tools, there are going to be third-party apps that can elevate your app management experience to a whole new level. So one such powerful tool is Wondershare Dr. Phone an all-in-one file manager designed to simplify and enhance the way that you interact with your apps and data on Android devices. In this section, we're going to introduce you to Wondershare Dr. Phone and explore its key features, empowering you to take full control of your Android apps effortlessly. Wondershare Dr. Phone is a comprehensive Android management software trusted by millions of users worldwide as a best file manager for Android. So with its intuitive interface and an impressive array of features, Dr. Phone empowers you to manage your Android apps, data, and devices with ease. Whether you want to back up, transfer, recover, mirror, or erase data, Wondershare Dr. Phone offers a versatile set of tools to cater to your needs making it an essential companion for any Android user. So let's begin with Android Phone Manager. Wondershare Dr. Phone allows you to manage your Android apps efficiently. You can transfer data from PC slash iTunes to Android and vice versa. Similarly, you can transfer data from iCloud to Android devices just like that. Android Phone Backup. Safeguard your app data, and files with Dr. Phone's reliable backup feature. You can create full backups of your apps, ensuring that your precious data is protected in case of accidental data loss or even device failure. Android Screen Mirror So with the screen mirroring feature, Dr. Phone enables you to display your Android device's screen on your computer in real time. This is especially useful for showcasing apps, making presentations, or sharing your mobile screen with others. Android Screen Unlock If you forget your device's lock screen password or PIN, Dr. Phone can actually help you unlock your Android phone safely. You can unlock all types of locks like PIN, password, pattern, fingerprint, and even face lock. With it, you can also bypass Google FRP lock. Android Data Recovery So did you accidentally delete an important app or lost data? Dr. Phone's data recovery feature can efficiently retrieve lost or deleted app data from your Android device. Android WhatsApp Transfer Dr. Phone facilitates seamless WhatsApp data transfer between Android devices, making it super easy to switch phones without losing your chat history, media, and attachments just like that. Android Phone Transfer Upgrading to a new Android device? Well, Dr. Phone simplifies the process of transferring apps and data from your old phone to the new one effortlessly. Android Data Eraser Worried about data privacy? Dr. Phone's data eraser ensures that your sensitive information is permanently deleted from your Android device, leaving no room for recovery. Android System Repair If your Android device encounters any kind of issues or becomes unresponsive, Dr. Phone's System Repair feature can help fix various system-related problems, bringing your device back to its optimal state. And with that, today's video has reached its end. So thank you for watching this video all the way up until the very end, and we hope that this video helped you in your efforts to manage apps on Android effectively. To show your appreciation, you can give the video a thumbs up and even let us know your feedback in the comments. Lastly, do remember to subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon. Now, until next time, have a good one.